So what if Russia formed a thousand years early? Technically, Russia has been around for a really long time, but I'm talking about like the 1991 Russia, the one that we know. is the year 867. We are way more than a thousand years, like a thousand years plus, and they have their modern borders and a little bit more, actually. They actually have like thick mustache daddy's borders. I didn't realize I gave them a lot of Central Asia. Now, because we're in the medieval times, this man is going to be crucial for the survival of Russia. If Russia is going to last longer than like a decade, this man needs to make some great moves fast. He's got no wife, he's got no kids, and I'm sure he's going to be dealing with a lot of uprisings. He's going to have to hold on to this. But if he can hold on to all this, then everyone is going to be at his fingertips because no one will be able to stop him. There's not a single nation. He's just got to survive in the very beginning, which he doesn't even need to survive. I'm sure he'll lose land. He'll lose some stuff. He just can't lose a lot. He should also focus on spreading this big, beautiful Russian culture. I want to see a whole lot of Slav squatting when we're about through with this. Adidas and vodka everywhere. In terms of faith, I guess he should probably do the same thing. That would help, I think, keep it all together, maintain it. And of course, the big question, will Mongolia show up? Because I don't exactly know. If Russia starts losing this stuff and we get around to that time period where Genghis likes to go, you know, haha, -ha, horse people, let's burn everything down. I think Russia could have problems? At that point, they'd probably be attacking Eastern Europe, and then they'd be opened up to a two-front war. We need to pay very close attention to this first Tsar of Russia. He is the most important. He has quite a lot of siblings, which actually is maybe really bad. Maybe that could cause problems. I think it would. Well, nonetheless, this is the first czar. He's 24. Let's see. Luckily for him, he's a master of intrigue, and he also is, uh, well, he's craven chass. Oh, that could be actually bad. He needs to have a lot of kids. Bro, you need to get an heir stat. Well, I guess he has an heir, but it's his brother. I realize how OP they look on the regular map mode, but they aren't that strong. They have a lot of things they have to develop still. I mean, all the good stuff is really in India, and at least this part of Europe. This isn't super valuable land just yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Or maybe you don't want that to change because, you know, you always have the blizzards on your side. If anyone tries to invade, blizzards come, knock everything down, including armies. Probably not good that this first Russian czar is terrible at, uh, martial skill. Ter he's zero. Oof. Oh, no. No, no, no. Okay, so there already is several uprisings all throughout their lands. But you know what? That's Russia's used to that. Don't they like it anyways? Communists. Up Can we get the Soviet Union a thousand years early? I think this is going to be normal. They're going to be constantly in battle with something and multiple. I don't think they're they're ever going to be at peace. I'd be surprised if they're only in a conflict with one other person. Nice. Okay, so he does have a nice 36-year-old, only two years younger. This Russian czar is also trying some experimental poisons, already starting with those KGB tactics. So Spectator Dad has just found some very juicy stuff. I see everything out here. We see all secrets. This heir to the Russian throne is not legitimate. The first Russian queen, czar Russian queen, uh, had a a kid with her lover. Chieftain whoever, Dolga Jar. Rip. Big rip. So that could cause some problems in the future when this guy goes because uh, I don't know who that kid is. Your son? Don't be messing with me, game. That's not my son. I mean, that's that's not your son, Russia. And not too far away, we have all of Brittany, or almost all of Brittany, being taken over. Not surprising. The Vikings are always going to do wild stuff in the very beginning. Wow, I just realized it makes a whole lot of sense. What if they didn't even do anything? What if these two didn't even smash? And he knows it too because he doesn't like intimate contact and he's all of a sudden she just pops in. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> this food knows. He knows. This is not his kid. Armani? Armani. Fashionable. Very. I like it. Ouch. And it did happen. Now this is still like a rush. This is, I, I don't even know. Maybe they really are doing a communist uprising. That's a big beautiful red. I'm not gonna lie. I felt really weird seeing Russia as yellow. So immediately when this guy passed, this is what happened to Russia. Luckily he did end up having three kids, but like who knows how many are actually his. So this illegitimate child controls this random spotted Russia, and uh, this 13-year-old is Tar Taria. Terraria? He likes that game too. Oh, and that's nice. Tsar Nikita has gotten Siberia. That must be really, like, a small place. So this family tree is only going to continue to grow. It's going to be, well, hopefully it's going to grow wide. If it goes straight down, that would be bad. <laughs> Trust me. Whoa, West Francia just dropped the West. You you guys are just Francia now. You're you're basically bringing back Charlemagne's empire. You took back the middle part and the eastern. Why are you showing up, my Russian dude? This this you're making this. I don't even want to worry about that drama. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna fall apart when he goes. He's 62 and he did it all while stuttering. Beautiful King speech. Oh, ultimate twist. Russia has come together and it's actually come together under the Ill Ill legitimate kid. Can't talk. Oh, he's ill though. No, you united. 
Russia, and it's been a beautiful story, but you're ill. Oh, no. Well, he did go crusading, I think. Or at least he fought something. Oh, it's because the Terraria kid died. Oh. Natural cause is right. I, again, KGB, are you doing that stuff? Yeah, again, the only secret we know on this guy is he's almost certainly the illegitimate illegitimate child. This dude is his Faja. Once again, though, he's back to fighting a whole bunch of things. Uprisings and neighbors coming after him. As you can see, things don't look quite as clean as they once were. Oh, Siberia's still here. So there is like a split still in this Russian house. Oh, and this guy is what? Okay, by putting his wife behind bars. I see. Are you sure? Surprisingly, as almost every other place falls apart, West Frankia remains. Again, this man, he just keeps on going. 66. Not feeling well, though. Ooh. Another fight from the inside. But you know what? That doesn't look Russian. That looks like it's something else. That's an uprising from the people. All right, this is this is a way bigger problem now. Oh, I see. The Russians have found vodka. Tiny penalty. Okay. Let's see if they can defend their lands. It's going to be kind of tough uh, with all this scattered everywhere. Hey, they still have this. There you go. Let's also not count out Siberia, who still has that royal blood. They just ain't that powerful. Oh, well, we got a confederation and Moldavia. Weird things are definitely gonna happen here. Oh, Poland, you don't want to be in this universe. Greater Poland, lesser Poland, don't do it. Lithuania's here. I didn't think they were in this game. More? I'll have some. Nordmark. Okay, I gotta stop. <laughs> What is Nordmark? Northumbria has also control of Iceland for some reason. All right, Russia, you're starting to scare me a little bit. There's a lot of problems. I mean, that's a little uprising. It, they might squash it. Volga Ural, Volga something, they, they changed too over here. All right, that Russian blood clearly changed a lot. Here's our first czar of Russia. There's that one Terraria kid. This guy passed. We've got Eyepatch Man, Jack Sparrow himself, but clearly something is happening to the house. The dynasty's changing. That man looks different. People starting to look a little different in this house. <laughs> he has the name though, Ruslan. Okay. Okay. Let's also not forget, this guy controls Serbia, the small little Serbia. Technically, they can get all the land, right? He's the rightful owner, I would say. I just don't know how they're going to stop this big, obese um, man that's next to them. He is obese. I'm not just saying. That would be mean. No, he's officially obese. Because Volga Ural, Ural looks pretty good. And they're, you know, keeping things together for the most part. They're only fighting one other person. Oh, that's not too bad. Oh, they did it. They are just Frankia now. They dropped the whole west part. They're holding on to this somehow. So the air must have been, like, pretty clean cut. Ooh, he doesn't look clean cut. He was excommunicated. This is a crime to the emperor. He was imprisoned, banished, and revoked title in all, like, all religious services. I see. Yeah, like, what did you do, bro? What did you, you almost certainly, oh, he's just an ill- Legitimate child. Oh, good. Oh, it wasn't a clean break. King Charles, you didn't even come from West Francia. You came from that middle part. Lethargy and the, uh, and he's the <gasps> product. Uh. Cue Alabama anthem. Who are you doing? Who are you doing? And that's why he was excommunicated. Oh, snap. You were doing your sister. Which one was it? Which one was it? Did you? Oh, is it the one that's dead? Died of malnourishment. Who did you do? Girl, you gotta get out of there. This man is terrifying. Look, look at his, look at his face. You know something's up. Well, he has lover's pox. Dang, and he got that from his sister? Or maybe cousin, I don't know. Suffers from a guilty conscience. What? This man, this is a scary guy. <laughs> this guy's scary. As for other places in the world, we have Sweden looking like a pretty united Viking empire, although their time is starting to run out. Estonia, Estonia having the great, this is Estonia's best game. Like, I mean, CK3 is just like oh, Estonia's OP game. Ooh, Songhai forming down here in southern, sub-Saharan Africa. Let's go, Darfur, new. I'll take both of you and Egypt. Oh, that's a clean Egypt and some stuff happening in northern India, too Wow, really loving these names now. Look at that czar Stanislav does it get any more Russian than that Stanislav? I'm just waiting for Stanny Stan. Let's get it going Look how many Russian rulers we've been through but that guy from Siberia is still just chilling 64 And you know what he has no secrets the man is innocent honest. That's I think his biggest thing He's arrogant though. Ooh, Byzantium starting to make the euro struggle the Volga euro struggle a little bit taking some things how is russia still holding on to this that's crazy poland is here it's amazing this is actually okay but watch poland win this game frankie is here and they're invading england frankie is still frankia but now there is actually an east frankia oh also there's an aragon in iberia yeah what happened to that terrifying king okay this kid is 11 uh this is the kid wait what is that a furry this looks like a furry for a second with his beard and his nose louis the third okay and then this guy is the son of that really creepy king with all the problems so it seems russia is deciding to go with the strategy of moving south and that's probably a good idea just avoid that although this is kind of scary raj oh what the british over here making raj already raj put uh what okay that's 
Is that the Mongolians? No, 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 no. That's still Stanislavich. That's a different dude, though. Evil Black Guard? Okay. Ah, Stanislav. Okay, so they just changed their name. It's still Russia. Kind of. Still kind. Uh, yeah, he's still Russian culture, but I feel like... Uh, are they slowly becoming Mongolia? I think that's what's happening here. It's starting to all come together now. Serbia still surviving, arguably, the actual rightful Russia. This is Russia, honestly. And again, that just only proves it. Once again, this guy is not actually his son there was some uh messing around that was happening also he murdered his uh who i think he might have murdered somebody in his family actually somebody's wife ah yes sweden in morocco classic viking move there wow they are even in the mediterranean that is the deepest i've seen the Vo jerusalem so successful crusades i guess uh this man is 21 they have control uh yeah the uh muslims have been pushed back very far back wow th this is this is pretty s i've never seen them lose this badly catholicism still is pretty much there for the most part it's starting to lose its grasp in the british Isles, though. Bulgaria having trouble with Wallachia. Wallachia is breaking it apart. Francia still has control over a lot of a big portion of Italy. Sweden almost has all of Iberia. This is this is too much. They're definitely gonna lose this, right? Genoa. County of Genoa is here. Hunchback King in Francia. Very nice. Oof. Oh man, that's not right. His his wife cheated on him. Big old Pomerania. Haven't seen that thing of a Pomerania before. This man is looking good. 44. Look at this Scandinavia. I don't I don't even understand. Sweden and then Estonia. This is pretty cool. Oh, and then Alba in Denmark. There is no pieces of Russia, at least in Eastern Europe. Uh, I believe Russia. No, Russia's all gone. See me. See me. See me. Wanted to make sure that didn't say something else. We got a new guy and. Uh, uh, his special ability is there that he's also wise though humble temperate and content she does not look happy with him it's like does she know hold up does she know your secret bro i like when we have like a nice old ruler like this he just stays by it's like trusty old ruler he's always there athletic and possibly depressed weird combo there oof got yourself a lover i see you all right all right is your friend too that's nice friend and lover good combo oh my goodness that oh i i thought i was in a different map mode for a second there no, this is what happened to Russia. It's it's not it just disappeared it's not like they lost it over a fight it just one day everything popped out well you can't say this is inaccurate okay i said 1991 russia what happened to russia like a year before that the same thing not this bad not this drastic but you know soviet union dissolves okay historically accurate all right so this is the uh basically de facto russia actually no it's not and doesn't siberia have like some claims to all this i don't think so actually boris the second man there's so many Borises coming out of siberia drinking binge and a drunkard man you need to get your life together there's a lot of land for you to Conquer. Yeah, like this whole side of the tree is super done goofed. It's all messy. These families are getting huge. We gotta go all the way this way to get to Boris. Wait, this guy passed? Who passed? I don't know, but Boris the second took over. He got five kids too. He's ready to go. Look how crazy this tree is getting. All stemming from that first czar of Russia. He's still having an impact, that's for sure. Farsi has formed in Persia. There's a lot, there's a lot of fighting that's gonna be happening here, especially with all this, like, this power vacuum. Ooh, Siberia's getting some land! Let's go, Siberia! Yo, I gotta root for Siberia. He's the rightful ruler. He should have all this, kind of. I mean, to me, he should. It, to me. Kingdom of Italy is still here. It's just really depressing. And Francia continues to be a huge thorn in everyone's side. Bulgaria? What the? Why is Bulgaria in Sardinia? And North Africa? Nice. So we have Louis the Fourth in Francia. He's 24, looking epic. He also has a duchess. Uh, he has a Dutch... Flanders. Flanders is his lover. Damn, she 50. All right, bro. All right. Dang, you 24. Your wife's 48. Oh, you like, okay, you like cougars. All right. Your dad is your heir? What's wrong with this man? What happened to this man? Oh, yeah, this was the excommunicated guy. I forgot about that. Slash hunchback. Slash, slash hunchback. Oof, he was a witch. This character practiced witchcraft. Yeah, they had to get him out of there. Get him out of Frankia. Damn. Yeah, something for sure wrong with this family. Not only did they have that creepy French ruler with all the lovers, he had problems. Then they had a Hunchback, witch-loving, excommunicated man. Hey, but you know what? To their credit, they're keeping it together, man. They, they're doing good. Oof. For now, they're doing good. They might be in the middle of World War... Uh, well, European Continental War One. This is scary. Francia versus the Vikings. The Swedish Vikings who have everything. Oh, well, Francia is the attacker. They've got 20,000 troops. Sweden is losing this. What happened, Sweden? Ouch. Yeah, they've been losing some battles. Okay, it's fine. Ooh, but they do need to worry about this uprising. There seems to be a little bit of a revolt. Yep, independence. East Francia is trying to gain the freedom. Amorania took a big old chunk out of Bavaria. Now we've got disgusting borders like this. Thanks, guys. We have an England. An England that has formed out of Alba. That kind of. Well, Alba's still here, but England is now in Denmark. 
Denmark and they're in Northern British Isles. Estonia is still here in Estonia. Why? Why is Estonia? This is like CK3. How did the Vikings take over so much? This is actually going to be depressing because they're going to get kicked out of Iberia. Maybe the Umayyad might come back. It's still overwhelmingly Muslim here in this region of Europe. And uh, well, there's Cathars coming out. Some changes to faith a little bit at least. Oh, and then this making its move up in the northern part of the Scandinavian territory. Always love this. A zero year old controlling pretty much one of the biggest nations in Africa. And he's a giant. How do they know he's going to be a giant at zero? Does he come out that big? There's actually a lot of things growing in Africa. Ghana. Uh, Mali is here. Whoa. Ooh, and Byzantium completely obliterated Egypt's coast. Egypt's not even here. Wait, so is there going to be a Mongolia or no? This is basically Mongolia, I guess. Yeah, Khan. Oh, good, good. Norway's here. We got a nice little sandwich in between. Uh, we got like a, I don't even know if this is a Nordic sandwich. Uh, I mean, Estonia's always wanted to be Nordic. Oh, well, they are in this universe. Karen? Again, I thought this was Karen. Ah, I wish it was just said Karen. Someone's got to stop Sweden. It, it ain't going to be Frankia, even though Frankia is winning their wars. Is that Sweden too? No. They have all of the British Isles, almost all of Ireland. Ireland does exist though. The Croatia, Bulgaria is like this disgusting line, I guess. Well, it's not a line. It, it's gross though. Can we get an F in chat? Oh yeah, chat. Let's get them some air. Ha. Uh, I've been waiting to use that for a while. This is the most powerful Adjuran Adjuran I've ever seen. Just gonna pretend like that's how you pronounce it. Oh, having never processed the death of a loved one, this character finds it harder to connect with others. Ouch, what happened? Dang, I'm so oh, is it your spouse? Oh, it was slain about maybe it was. Or was it your first spouse? Ooh, who was it? Who was it? Lustful. Ooh, could be a problem. Yep, so this is Coptic. I wonder if they're spreading that Coptic faith. You know what? No, you don't care about any of those men. You have a lover, so you're fine. You have a lover and they are in Morocco. They are in Iberia, man. They are, that's a far lover. He gets away with it pretty easily, too, because his wife is blind. Dang, that's not right. That is not right. Or is it his twin? We don't even know. You could be with his twin this whole time. You wouldn't even know. This man is wheezing. You know what? She could be blind. She'll know he ain't around. He ain't wheezing. Or he'll hear, like, wheezing in, like, a distant bedroom. She knows what's up. Byzantium now moving straight up north. And as you can see, Russia is... Crab Rave gone. Somewhat, somewhat Crab Rave gone. Not entirely though, because again, there is Serbia. Who is spreading? They've got three different parts with Ob. Please tell me, man, you could do this. Please. Czar Iv Avank. Va whatever. Oh, he's possessed. Well, maybe he'll be possessed by the first Russian czar and unite everything. You're the one place that had good heritage. How did it finally happen? Oh, you know what? You didn't- I don't even think you were illegitimate. I guess it might be just disputed, but it- you don't have any secrets. Oh, yeah, his mother doesn't have any secrets either. I think that's just made up. That's messed up. Yeah, maybe you guys will come back as communists. That would help. Oh, I remember you. Okay, you guys are still there, kind of. Somewhat. Glad Denmark has found some time to get a little vacation spot in Africa. Right next to their homies Sweden. That's beautiful. What's going on in France? Oh, France led by an empress who does not have a face or is horribly ugly. She's drunk too. How does she even drink like that? Dang, she's 68. You didn't even know. <gasps> Galicia just annexed all of Sweden. That's a that's an epic Galicia. Oh my goodness, she is disfigured. She's hunchback. She's drunk. She logical. Oh my goodness. Of course, you know, you have some bad combinations, girl. I wouldn't want to do stuff either. I'd be pretty against that. Damn, it hasn't stopped her from having like Three husbands? Hell yeah, all right. She got two kids. Oh, one's dead. Dang, you know, that must have been tough for her. She doesn't like to do it anyways. And then when she did, someone, they didn't even make it? Well, just do it for Frankia. You gotta keep him alive. They better watch it because Frankia's still getting awfully close to not having like a super legit heir. This perfect combo of uh, having it for both the kingdom of East Frankia and West Frankia. This next heir is 45 with a 12 year old. Come on, he's 12, bro. Is that her son? Oh, yeah. I mean, they're, no, that's not a son, but. Ugh, that's weird. That's a gross Iberia, and we even, yeah, Galicia kind of makes it worse. Bulgaria is even more. Bulgaria is imperializing Africa. We've got a dishonorable villain out here in Siberia, but they are still moving. I like that they're still kind of getting some land slowly. Dang, this family has 247 members, but we only have 68 alive currently. They have more renown, renown than uh, whatever Frankie has got. So, you know, they were pretty epic back in the day. Not so much anymore. What is Dulo? Dulo. Disgusting India. Man, every time, like, Raj starts to form, it just falls apart. Oh, Persia's here, though. Oh, boy. There is a Mongolia, Zardom of Mongolia, and that lady, she don't look like Genghis Khan to me. She is Russian. We might, oh my goodness, that could be the way the Russians come back. A Mongolian Russian invasion. Holy crap, who is this man? He is scary. That's mean. I don't think he's ugly, but yeah, he is scary. Just like searching through all these former Russian lands, there is actually a lot of people from that former house. Like a lot of them. It's still Russia. A lot of them are Russian, these leaders. That's what's causing the problem. They, their family got too big, probably. Oh man, this Mongolian queen. 
Jean has herself a nice little, uh, her spy master is also her lover. Damn, you got all you kids in jail? They're four and three. Why are they in jail? Even though the Russians have fallen apart, it's still leaving a huge impact on this world because, uh, the Mongolian queen is related to the Finnish queen. This, this far away from the map. Is this one of those giants? Why are there so many huge people? Can you give me some of that? Give me some of that tall juice. I'll drink that. Empress Jadviga. Empress Jadviga. Oh, she gone. She dead. Was she Polish? Okay, this is bad news. This is bad news. We got a 12 year old and she's a bleeder. Not a great combo. Any kind of wound might prove fatal to uh, Adele. Oh, she's Adele. Okay, good singer, I guess. She's fighting four different conflicts. She's winning three out of four of them. Yo, mama, can you help her? She's bleeding? Don't let her bleed. I'm just waiting for this thing, this whole thing to collapse. I feel like it's close. Y'all better start mating. That's weird. They're 12 and 13. They're 13. Big, scary, Byzantine Empire king right here, and he's continuing to spread. He's looking fine. Look, Everything's looking pretty safe for him. Oh, boy. Yep. Civil War in Francia, kind of. Or uprisings. East Francia, once again, trying to get their freedom. Don't do it, king. Don't do it, king, Andres. Rig. Ha? Huh? Rig ha. Maybe rig ha will stop Bulgaria. No, keep it together, lady. Keep it together. I like this. 64 and 15, man. Maimed has been seriously maimed. What? What's that mean again? Maimed. Wound or injured so that part of the body is permanently damaged. Oh, okay. That's not that bad. How is she even still alive? Put the twin in charge. It's perfect. Oof. This guy is an adulterer, but his current wife is a giant. Why would you mess with that? Don't mess with that. And she's finished too. Be careful, bro. Oof. Got caught with your lover. Bam. Fornicator. Terrible. Terrible. Virgin gang. Norway has escaped to Iceland. Maybe they'll go to Newfoundland. Keep going. I wish that was a part of this. England is back somehow. I don't, I don't know how that's happening. Crusader queen. Look at that. A great warrior queen who has carved her own kingdom out of the lands of the infidels. Wow. She had to fight a lot to get her freedom. Look at all these truces she had. She fought everyone. Or she legit fought everyone. I'm just so surprised Galicia is still around. That's like the biggest uh, incestuous cousin. Is that your cousin? 38. No, I don't think that's your cousin. Hey, man, if all I had to do was do some stuff with some family members to get Galicia to this big, you know I would do some stuff with my Glizzy too. Galicia for the Glizzy. Glizzy for the Glizzia. <laughs> I think Byzantium is really benefiting from the collapse of Russia. They are loving this. I mean, like I said, this has no doubt made a massive impact on this game. Basically, all of Asia is controlled by some Russian blood. We've got Russian culture everywhere. So all the Mongolians that are popping out are a part of this weird... Like, there was a lot of merging that happened over the course of those years. But the Mongolians are basically half Russian, half... Mongolians. Scary combination if you ask me. They're all from this house, which is pretty cool because you can like actually see it too. You could see it in them. Venice! Oh my goodness, Venice is possible in this game? Most sincere Republic of Venice. Siren? Siri? What is that? Sincere. It's not sincere. Italian. That's amazing. Oh, Frankia. Frankia, back off, Frankia. I need you to not. I need you to leave definitely Venice alone. Again, Empress Adele doing good with her man right there. She's still holding on to Frankia. She's still her bleeder. Yep, she never fixed that. And she was ex communicated that why would you excommunicate her what'd you do wrong please don't tell me it was something creepy don't tell me family stuff oh i don't know what she did there we go siberia keep on growing they, i they i still think they got a chance i mean this man is terrifying he looks like he got some issues and he do uh he do got some issues loves that brothel apparently clearly oh poor lady crazy that bulgaria has survived for this long and they have santa claus as their ruler dang santa got a lot of kids too i guess he needs a lot of elves for the workshop or for the camps the labor Gotta say, I'm kind of rooting for this bleeder in Frankia. She's still going. She's got her man in prison. Wait, who's got your... No, somebody else got your man in prison, but it's fine. Dang, this house, this former Russian house from the first Russian czar, they got hand culture in their house now. This dynasty is getting so big. The Chinese are now, like, just north of the Black Sea. That's how far they're getting in. That They were just mixing. That's just mixing with everything now. Russian, Chinese, Mongolia. I'm sure there's probably some, like, Afghan, maybe? Oh, and we have this albino Mongolian now. Legit, he's albino. I know, and he's from the Mongolian area. Uh, he, he likes hash. He did so much. It ruined him for six months. This man went to a whole nother level with the ganja. I didn't think that was possible, but I've always thought in my head it, it could happen to me. Ooh, this peasant leader from all the way down here? Emre? They're, they're in England now. Don't know why. England continues to have problems. England is still here, though. Yeah, there's a lot of mixing going on. There's a lot of mixtures. Just all sorts of different lineages. In terms of faith, look at this. Overall, that spread it. Even though Russia didn't last, they made sure the faith thing had an impact. Because, look, all those, all those nations 
just kept this. They adopted that permanently. I'm wondering, like, what is this going to do to, like, the hordes? Did they go back to being hordes, basically? No, they're all feudal. There's really only, like, a handful of just spots of tribal. So Russia had an impact by developing this region in different ways. Oh, but did they actually develop it? That looks developed. Oh, they did develop it in different ways, for sure. Some areas more than others but okay finally in terms of culture there is uh not a lot yeah culture takes a very long time russian looks definitely different russia did not start off like that i don't even know what to say about some of this stuff but uh yeah okay it's, you know normal the problem is this area would be a whole lot easier to unite at any point you get the right guy to come up maybe a scary vodka genghis khan every time i check on this guy he is always in prison oh no the bleeder is obese that doesn't seem like a good combination obese and a bleeder Maj Madrid has formed in Iberia, so has Valencia, so there's some- oh, never mind, it's all gone. Nastrid. NASCAR, Genoa here too. I like that Venice still stands. Please stay alive, Venice. Ooh, Frankie are running out of gold, and she's not even in a battle with anyone. You're running out of gold, you don't have much piety, and your military is only 5,000. For this big of an empire, you only have got 5,000. That's a bad sign. Galicia fell somewhat, but Galicia still stands in Scotland and Northern Ireland. Oh my goodness, would you look at that? Now that is pretty awesome. Look at this, Sweden. Big old Viking Swede. Normal, you know, scary looking dude. Whoa! Queen Namus? Queen Namus? And that would be because the Swedes have been uh, doing a lot of raiding all around the map and he's a seducer that probably doesn't that probably helps a little bit too. Oh man, this game gets crazy. Ooh, he does have a bastard son though. Ouch. Um, oof. Okay, Let's just keep that under wraps. All good. Very disappointing that communism didn't rise up a thousand years early too, but maybe it would have still. Maybe they're doing that right now in one of these duchies. I bet you they're practicing it. Thanks for watching. See you next time. A big thanks to Douchebaggins. Popcorn 2008. Garland, Land of Gar. Julius Cheese. Can't think of a name. Prime Minister Zephy. Peyton. Fusion. Drew, Wolf. this is your dad. I am leaving you. Manny, Manny, 74. Rossi, Trey. My Deezer, one, two, three. Every Giglet. time communism Mac. has been tried, Rats it has Arian after Pan, hours, Pan, Luxembourg, Scarlet, Mayonnaise Incorporated, Hipster, Lama, Orlin, Maxi G, Alfonso, 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 Alfonso,